Welcome back, everybody, to Chinelli's and Farms here on Farming Simulator 17. We got another load of bales here, bringing up to the cow farm. Going storm for now. Uh, we're going to get our storage full, and then we'll worry about selling some. Uh oh. Uh, I done told some of y'all that are new that I have a glitch in the map. Um, it's right there between those two buildings. Actually, from the seed last, the first seed master that you come to, and uh, this barn, third barn there, in between there, there's a glitch. Uh, I still haven't got to look under the map yet. But hopefully today we'll get done harvesting. Uh, folks, I've got a grass field here. Uh, I'm going to make a road right through here and make it come over to here maybe something like that and uh, so we can unload our bales and as you can see maybe one more load oh, wrong, wrong thing I'm looking for straw bales uh, storage space 18 so 18 left And then we almost got this in full. I think one more straw bale, square bale, and that will be full if I'm not mistaken. So, yep, one more bale for that. And then we'll need uh, 47 grass bales and uh, 22 hay bales. And for those who are wondering, the uh, difference between straw and hay is, uh, I mean, uh, grass and hay. Sorry, grass and hay. Grass is just a raw cut. You don't do that to it except mow it and bale it. Uh, hay, you t tether it. Uh, you gotta get a drying machine. All it does is toss it out wide and you have to roll it back up. And that's uh, when you spread the grass out from mowing it just gives the air to uh, to dry out and stuff and yes I'm cutting across these fields because I'm in a hurry and I don't know why I think that's a good song I really do um yeah uh okay Donna has a full green tank be right over at Donna I'm not even going to worry about putting this one back on. I am going to worry about shutting it off. Um, let's go ahead and get this combine started. I started to want to get the, the uh, distance back in them again because they caught up to each other. Uh, got Birch Video 573 and Donna on the combines. And me on the green buggy. Uh, got both trucks here empty. I just hope they hold what's left. We don't have that much left, actually. Uh, this is what you see right there, a rye. Let me get on uh, under this combine so it'll be unloading. And we'll take a look at the map, see what we got left. Unless it's... Okay, this is going to stay put. That's good. We can look at the map real quick. Uh, 17 is rye, that's why it's not on there, but, uh, 18 we done done. We have 19 and 20 left, so 19 is canola, uh, 20 is going to be sunflowers, 33 is going to be barley, I forgot about it. So we got pretty much all these fields right down through here, everything that's green here, folks, in case y'all knew, everything that's in green, so we got 32, 33, 20 all these fields right here and then 10. Um, thinking about buying nine next. I know I'll be able to afford it. Here's nine or 11. Um, I don't want to buy no more down this way until we get some more of these up across here. So maybe we'll start buying these four little ones because I know we'll have the money after we sell all of our rye. Um, 
Birch video might make it back down here. I'm not for sure. Um, but as you can see here, they they'll should have it wiped out pretty soon. I don't know why the auger's still out on that. Probably because I started it with the out. Thought it would go back in. Uh, or wood chips. Well, yeah, not very much in there. So uh, we'll get back to that. Got a little spot right here in front of the bucket to clean up. I've been trying to keep the cows and sheeps uh, clean. Um, ain't very many here. Let's take a look at our animals real quick. We have four cows, which are probably going to need some power food here pretty soon. And our sheeps are all good and full. Uh, 18 of those. Uh, well, we get our productivity up, which is pretty much the health on them. Um, they'll start reproducing. Uh, zero loan. We're going to try to keep it that way. Um, also, to show y'all here on the group, you can see 19, 20, and 33 is not ready yet. So, once we get 17 done, we're going to take the combines in, probably wash them up, change the heads on them. Um, let's see, let's look at soil. We're going to have a lot of fields to plow, so that's no biggie. Also on our map here, um, all depends on which field gets done or ready next. Um, I wish we had a way of telling, really. Um, they're all green, so I'm pretty sure they're, they're the same green. I'm pretty sure they're going to get ready at the same time. Uh, I'm pretty sure of that. Uh, let me hop back to the combines. Whew. Bart's video almost got by. And he got full right here at the hill. Ah, go figure. I think, yeah, he's going to be the one that takes off. Which I'm glad, you know, that was, uh, try to stay up with them. Uh, as long as the combine is moving, it's making money, paying for itself. But, uh, well, we got that going way too fast. I gotta move all my tractors out of S1 slot. If I hit shift, you can see if I hit one, it's gonna take me to a tractor instead of set my cruise speed. So all these tractors are gonna be getting moved to probably group two. Because it's much easier to uh, hit S1 than it is to hit RB, right B, and all that. I don't know. I doubt we can hold all this in the green but Oh, the other one's 100%. Man, I should have went the other way. Been faster. I just didn't want to up that hill and back down. But yeah, um, when we get harvest done, y'all probably gonna be like uh, getting a big surprise on some tractors uh, we're gonna have backup by the way so I'm just gonna put this dude out here a little bit so I can back up probably should have stayed back a little bit but I'm gonna just de-hire so I can yeah do like this get out of uh, Bert's video 573 Gerald appreciate you coming out man uh oh 
He might get it off. Oh, wow, that's... Mm, good dokey. Take over a little bit, but now nah, I didn't get it either. There you go. Man. There you just hit her. Wow, that opens wide. Can you imagine being ate by a combine hitter? Coming after you. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Forgot, forgot. There, hit B to lower. There we go. There we go. Oh, folks, we're almost done with the ride. All right, we are done here. Let's, oop, 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 can't back up. Uh, I'm afraid we're going to be missing some, folks. Yep, ain't wide enough to get it. Wow. Get that little piece there. All right. So, bailing. It's going to be the next thing. I, I, I'm sure of. Alright, we're almost down. There we go. Alright, um, we're going to take these guys in and uh, wash them up a little bit. I'm just going to leave that right there. It's a buggy. We need to go unload. Uh, Oh, Sarah took over. Okay. Sarah don't have very much to do. Let's see, we got 42 in this and I'm just hoping this Bob truck will hold it all. Alright, let's make sure we can uh, dump here. Yep. And we're going to go to this season here. We're going to go over. We're going to go all the way down to Rye. Rye. Oop, pass it. According to that, we need to sell today. We need to sell Rye today, folks, according to that. So let's go over to our store menu here. Um... Which one is our rye? Probably gonna be that right there since it's showing that we got almost 200,000 liters. Uh, 13. Hey, where my mouse go? Oh, great. All right, so 1378, 1390. And 1390 is Farmer's Choice, which is going up. I don't know why, where my mouse went to. Let's close out, go back in. There we go. Farmer's Choice is 1390, and the price is going up. So, time we get ready to sell, it should be about right. Um. Well, trying to see the bat signal. All right, Sarah's completed her chores. Let me shoot this off. Actually, no. Let me. Ooh, that's not good. Huh? We're going to unload direct in the truck instead of using a buggy. Okay, now I'll shut it off. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. She got all this in. 
Put this follower back down. I think there's a little strip down here. Might not be worth nothing to worry about. Every ounce counts, so get it. Every ounce counts. Yeah, but maybe a hundred foot or so. We'll go ahead and take it out. There we go. Auger out. Uh, I just hope that the bob truck there will hold the rest of this. Which I'm hoping it will. Uh, yeah, the DTX 410 Twin Stars, 75%, so it'll hold it no problem. So that'd be good. This will put us over to 200,000, so that's two loads in a truck. I'm going to move this guy over. Probably take one up here a little bit. We need our uh, wagons in a way. I guess I can squeeze on up to the farm shop. Um, let's see, that's soybeans right there. I know soybeans won't be ready for a while. So, um, like I said, we got barley uh, down there, but it's not ready. And uh, sunflowers and soybeans, I think, is what we got left. I'm not mistaken. Um, Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, that's what we got left. Oh, me, oh, my. Um, I don't think this header's going to fit through here. No, it's... It'll fit through the barn. Oh, I forgot I haven't widened the, the collision on this yet, so we can't go through there. We'll have to go around this way. And I'm wanting to mow this grass before I take any heavy machinery through there. So I'm just going to leave the combine here. And that. And, uh, I moved the forklift over here so once that bale there gets about 98, 99% or even 100, I'm going to move it and move it down here. That way we'll... Uh, Oh, come on now. Um, has that field been fertilized? Um, yeah, that's what I was. That now and there, farmer's chores. Got to watch it. Uh, crap, I just want the map. Oh, here we go. Uh, go to... Uh, yeah, it's been plowed. Where has it? Okay, so it's been fertilized. I need to fertilize 17.5. Actually, I just need to fertilize uh, 17 before I plow it. So we'll get uh, a couple tractors running here. Um, go ahead and get this guy going. You're going to need some fertilizer, but before I go all the way back, I'm going to just go ahead and throw some out. Um, there we go. Get that off. We're gonna auto good. Make new. Move it over. And this is just so I don't use. As you can see down through there, it's uh, pretty well set. All right, there we go. And hire a worker. Six. Come on now, we can do better in six. Put it back up in the right spot there. Um, yeah, whoa, right this way. 
We'll get our tractor going here. Because we done fertilized that. And now all we got to do is work it in. We got to get as much field work done we can uh, today because it's going to start raining tomorrow. Then uh, skip a day, rain again, skip a day, rain again. So we're going to try to get as much fall, fall work we can get done. Okay, we got Jennifer on that, and uh, Junior on the other tractor. Uh, I guess we need to go ahead and get this combine out of the field. How much did we get? 47,804, so that's not bad. We'll get this combine here out of the way. And um, park it here in the middle. And our Argo wagon is uh, pretty much in the way too, so park him right here. Let's get this guy in the middle. Our eight RT. Um, if we make a, a good amount of money on the rye when we sell it, we're probably going to get a couple more tractors, folks. Uh, we're going to get a couple of track tractors like this, a couple of 9Rs. Uh, see, I don't want that quite yet. Not, not yet. I'm going to do that off screen. Um... I am going to go put that one in the uh, get this and to follow this truck up just going to get it out of the way because we are going to till up all this green right here folks it's going to be all one big field pretty soon can y'all imagine that um Fertilizer's down to four percent. Oh that. He should run out before he gets to the baler. Uh, we got our tender truck right there, so it's no biggie on that part. Now I'm gonna watch because on our one episode, I can't remember which one it was. I think it was Oregon Springs where our truck was following us and he started going AWOL and went out in the field doing circles and uh, tearing up the crops. So now I kind of watch them when they're around crops because I don't want them wasting their crops, you know? I'm actually going to cut across over here. Go down. Well, we got one tractor free, I believe, and we're going to probably get it doing a little bit of everything. Oh, I see your truck wrecked already. Who's driving that? Donna, I wrecked her truck. Yeah, she's been putting a lot of hours in, but still. Yeah, control F. Um, we're probably going to fix it a load up, so I'm just going to park this truck behind this one. But, um, let's go ahead and shut it off. Let's see how much rye we got now. Soybeans, 1602. Beets, 36550. Uh, 70,000 on sugar beets. Rye is 246,000 folks. Uh, corn is 109,000. 
barley is 133,000. So we, we're getting a good amount of storage right there. I'm going to try to go this way, but I know. Yep, see, right there. It caught us. It caught us. That's what happens when I turn that way. Uh, oh, see, I don't need to take this truck back to the field. I need to probably park it right here for right now. Um, let's see here. We need our baler. Going strong. Got that end looking good. We got to get on the hay bale. Ah, he ran out right there. Uh, we'll get to him here in a minute. I'm actually wanting this guy right here. We're going to make sure work position. And we're going to start everything up. And then we're going to hire a worker. We got Donna. Donna's going to try again. She's putting those hires in. All right, we're going to take this guy. Well, we got about four to three minutes, folks. So uh, we're going to grab this thing right here and take it back to shop, too. It's our bumper. Let's run this guy back up. We're going to hook him to the mower. And we're going to see if we can hire a worker on mowing. Since we uh, got to do some field work and stuff. We'll just let the, the plow and the baler run while we get over here and mow. Get this gray box off of here. Now there's two ways we can do this. Um, we can hook the mower up and just mow. Mow, 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 mow. Or we mow and bail. Uh, mower's over here. Uh, wait a minute, I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think I got rid of the, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, I got rid of the square baler. I, I thought I was going to keep it, all. I don't know, we have to look in the shed, uh, got to fold him up so we can get out of here, oh, 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 got hung a little bit. I got home again. Um, let me just go over here real quick. Go through here. Go through here. Nothing in that shed. Okay, I'm not seeing a baler. Let's go to garage. Check lease vehicles. No lease vehicles. So that's good. Um... Looking for a baler. I know you can see the two sheds we got. There's a chrome baler right there. I bet you I trade it. I bet you anything. I sure didn't see it. Well, we need a square baler, uh, folks, badly. Uh, why did I do that? I go over here to baling technology. Um, I'm looking at a certain baler. This one right here. For our square bales. 188,000. Wow. That's 28,000. That's square. It looks like it would have shoots on the back. 28,000. We, we can't beat that, folks. Well, uh, we'll need a wind roller. I'm trying to cut down on uh, 
similar traffic time. Um, how many liters? Four thousand. It is John Deere. It's twenty eight thousand, folks. Let's go ahead and buy it and try it. Um, okay. So we're going to have to uh, have a wind roller too. Let's let me go over here and see how many bales we need for uh. I should have wrote this down. I wish it was that way. Uh, see, we don't need very many. Um, need 22 hay bales square. And 47 grass bales. So let's get our grass bales first. Um, what we're going to have to do is... Mo 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 mo. So uh, I'm gonna conclude this episode right here, folks. I just wanna y'all see a little bit of us mowing, and I'm actually going to redo this real quick. Um, I'm gonna put it on the back because that'll be better for a hired worker. And it being a feel it should hire a worker but uh let's see i'm gonna put it down turn both of them on let's get us a gray box it says hire a worker so let's get mowing real quick because i want to get our combines up in here but i want this to be mowed before we uh do that all right we have a hired worker Awesome. Let's see what he does real quick before we get off here. Um, hopefully he'll stop. This was a feel. It should stop. There he goes. And he's going to turn around. Awesome. Awesome sauce. That's what I'm talking about. That way he can be mowing that field. And then we'll mow around the edges what he don't get. And uh, hopefully we're going to... Uh, speed up or board processing plants um tell you what we're gonna go ahead and fill this with rye there we go and uh we're gonna take a load to farmer's choice probably gonna take a load to each one um as you can see here farmer's choice will go down when we sell and then we'll take it to Jacob's or Jeep's meal and then bakery we'll probably take it farmer's stores then bakery and then uh, Jeep's meal so that'll probably be on the next episode so folks I want to say thank you and uh, all the good stuff you know I love each and every one of y'all let's check on our baler real quick if I can find it Plow's doing good. He's almost done. Uh, I gotta get some fertilize. Oh my god. Why wasn't you picking up bales? He wasn't even started, so I guess that's one reason. I guess that's my fault. Uh, I guess he was too. Oh, the, I hit the trailer, but I didn't start the truck. Problem. That's what it was. All right, we're gonna have to go pick up all these bales. What's this? That, uh, some grass. I mean, straw I left behind. So uh, I'll work my way across the top here. Down. Well, folks, uh, I'm gonna pick up all these bales, and I will see y'all next time. Uh, this should fill storage up on the round bales and straw. Uh oh. Oh. But anyway. 
It's gonna be hard to get that. There we go. I bet you they all roll down that way. But anyway, I'm gonna trace down these bears, and uh, I will see y'all later, folks. Thanks for coming out, and seeing me, and uh, I appreciate y'all watching. And uh, yeah, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later.